All right, time to continue with this story. I love this game so much. So much it hurts. I don't even remember what I'm supposed to be doing. I think, uh, bitch Miriam. Hi, who is this? Sir, hello, hello, sir. Who are you? <laughs> Hi. Sheesh, welcome back, finally. Overseer helped you this time? Good. We've got plans to discuss. You've had a nice little adventure, yeah? Actually, I, I did, it's a pretty good adventure. Yeah, I have. Well, the fun part is over now. The next nexus point is in the middle of the ocean. Navigating out there is stupid. Uh, you fly. What does that even mean? So I'm jacking a ride with this captain. Oh, you're a sea captain, cool. Before that, I could fly you back home. Or you could stay here in Delphi Delphi. I don't care, it's up to you. So what's it gonna be? Um, I'm going to... What? What just happened? I'm not playing this game. I wanna save the world. So, I'm going with you. Huh? I dig this attitude. You're really ready to get serious about this? Uh, lady, I've been serious about this. I was born serious black. Yes. I'll be at the ship just outside of town. Don't keep us waiting. Okay, but I wanted to talk to the dope captain. Oh, Viola. I know that you didn't marry me in the end. And I know that you loved yourself more than you loved me. But I'm going on a dangerous adventure and I don't know when I'll ever be back to Delphi Delphi. So I wanted to tell you before I go that there'll never be another you. Also, you have something else to say? Going so soon? Besides me, you were the heart of the band and you were the heart of me. It's lonely on top. That's why you should marry me, Viola. I was trying to tell you, you would not listen. Viola, I think we really did something special. I think we are something special, Viola. Viola, why won't you love me, Viola? Viola! You're leaving me with Manny? No, you can come with me, Viola. I'll miss you, oh God. Viola, you're breaking my heart. <laughs> oh God, and Manny. Dang. So I guess that's it, huh? Yeah. Ash, how you doing? I'm sorry you're leaving. Nobody ever gave me a chance before like you did. Thanks. I think I'll keep playing with Manny and Viola if they want me. I hope someday you'll sing with us. You said that last time, Ash. I don't have time for your repetition. I wish I could talk to all of you again, but I... I kind of don't. All right, bye. Oh, what else, Manny? What? We'll keep playing, even without you. Our town needs us. But we won't ever forget you, Ace. Sorry, I ain't trying to guilt you here. But I can't lie and say this ain't sad, neither. We'll all miss you a bunch. I'll miss you too, Manny Depresso. Let's go. All right, Plague. It's time to save the world. Bad at you and saving the world. Miriam, are you warming up to me? Seems like it. Well, ready to go? I'm ready. Yeah, let's do this. Oh, look at that. They actually came to see me off. Well, so long, kiddo. This doesn't mean the end of the band, though, does it? No. No, it doesn't. Is that the end of the act? Act three. Voyage of the Lady Arabica. Oh my God, everything is about me. So strange. Should I call it the Arabica or Arabica? I'm gonna call it the Lady Arabica. What's up, Miriam? I'm looking so fly on this ship. <laughs> you know what I think it's time for? I think it's time for a little bit of mm, <laughs> scrambled eggs. <laughs> All right, but listen, I have to turn I have to turn the volume down in my ear. You don't know what I'm talking about, Miriam, but I do, and that's all that matters. Ba -ba -ba -ba. There we go. Oh, now it's perfecto prep. Miriam, what's up? Wow, a real pirate ship. Is this going to go for the entire trip? It might. 
Sarah's really cool, Miriam. Unlike you, you've been really nasty to me this entire time. I didn't want to say anything about it, but I think you might be a dick. Do you think Manny and Viola and Ash are doing okay? Who's that? Your band? We just left. I'm sure they're fine. Want to play a game? Like I Spy? No. Why don't you, like, explore the ship or something? You know what? I will do that, Miriam. Not because you told me to. Oh, God. Down it go. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. What's in here? Is this the captain's quarters? Oh, my God, Penny! I didn't know you'd be here, Penny. Do you have my beans, Penny? Well, if it isn't the bard of 101000 beans. I hope you realize you're never getting those beans. Oh. Oh, Penny, you hurt my soul, Penny. That's okay. I didn't really want them. I also still have no money. <laughs> so say we all. Right. I'm sort of the public face of the crew. You know, sell the beans, make the deals. I'm good at it because I'm so cute. You are so cute. You're like the Prince of Persia, but like the lady version. So I guess I could have said the Princess of Persia, but the way I said it was more complicated, and that's how I like it, Penny. I like it the hard way, Penny. What's up, Penny? Well, anyway, welcome aboard or something and stay out of the cargo. You want coffee? You can talk to Lou in the mess hall. I'm a tea drinker, Penny. Being a pirate isn't all fun and games. We've got a serious business enterprise here. People pay top dollar for coffee beans, you know. Yeah, I know people like them beans. Not me, Penny. I'm all about them leaves, Penny. I like that tea. Hello, bald man. I'm the navigator for this ship. No, I'm not even going to give you a voice. The only person who deserves a voice will be the captain. Meaning I keep us pointed in the right direction. And that goes beyond the literal. <gasps> Into the metaphysical? I don't tolerate silliness. Damn. Tell me more about it, stud. <laughs> me neither. Even though I just danced in your face. <laughs> I'm on a serious adventure. This is so for real serious. Oh, Francisco. All right. You seem like the silly type to me. Of course, they just let you on the ship without consulting me. I mean, that's fine. Just please don't break anything. Francesco, teach me of your ways. Ugh, I'm so tired. I can't even remember the last time I slept. So why do I still want more coffee? Hmm. That sounds silly to me, Francesco. What's up, dude? Look at him. That's either a spatula or an ice pop. I'm gonna guess ice pop, maybe? I don't know. Hi, sir. Getting hungry? I got plenty cooking up. If you don't like it, I'll kick your butt. That's not nice. That is not nice, Lou. I'm just here to love you. I've been on this ship a long time. Long before these youngins got their start. But I ain't a fighting man no more. The things I seen with one eye. Hmm. So maybe the things you half saw. Had to do something new when I lost my leg. Never really thought of being a chef. But turns out I had a real knack for it. Ain't that right, Francisco? Hmm. Uh, yep. You're very good at what you do. Your food's top notch, Lou. Top notch. You being sarcastic, bro? All right. Well, let's go see who else is here. Madam. Oh, wait. Penny told me to stay out of the cargo, didn't she? Well, I'm in here, Penny. What are you going to do about it, Penny? Huh? I'm going to French toast in here, Penny. You ain't stopping me from French toasting in the cargo, Penny. All right. Bye, guys. I really appreciate you. I want to sleep here. I want to sleep wherever Penny sleeps. Penny, where do you sleep? That's not a strange question to ask. All right, let's go meet the Capitan. Oh, Captain, my Captain. What's up, Captain LucasArts? I welcome aboard the Lady Arimika, matey. I already forgot how I said I was gonna pronounce it. What did I say? Lady Arabica, Lady Arabica, Lady Arabica, Arabica, that's what I said. QRS to you, welcome aboard the Lady Arabica. <laughs> yeah, this is so cool. Where are we going? To Tango Island Town. 
Are there more pirates there? Aye. You really like pirates, eh? They're pretty neat. Want to be a helpful part of our crew? How? Fetch me a coffee. Oh. Haha, <laughs> okay. We. Hmm. Captain Lucas, I'm giving you the worst possible accent I could ever give anyone, and I am not mad about it. I wasn't kidding about that coffee. I could really use some. All right, well. Being a pirate is fun, right? Tis a wonderful world to be part of, matey. All right, I'm gonna go stand out here, can I? Ah, loose lips sink ships, but nothing will ever sink this ship. This is the best ship in the world. Lady Arabica. I keep forgetting what I said I'd pronounce it as. Let's go get some coffee. Can you make me some coffee, Lou? Can I get a cup of coffee for the Capitan? Why, yes you can. There you go. Oh, God. This, this coffee's piping hot. Let me run. Ooh, maybe I should be careful so I don't spill it. Yep. Look at that. Look at the smoke coming off them beans. Here, Captain. Your order, sir. I brought you a coffee. So you did. Look at how dainty he drinks. It's so good. I feel a song coming on. <gasps> you don't know I know how to sing, Capitan. Oh, no. Yeah, it's about to happen, Miriam, whether you want it to or not. We about to break into some West Side Story shit. Only this is gonna be the on the ocean shit. All right, what you got, Capitan? What you got? We're the coffee pirates, and we sail the sea. Tell me about it. Tell me about it, Lou. Search. Searching for. Duh. <laughs> Coffee beans. We But we ain't no fiends uh, Unless Unless you You try To Take A Sweet Caffeine That's so dope, Captain Call me Lucas. I'm the cop or ten of this ship. You're the captain of this crew. Oh, Capitan! I'm Nina. Oh, you have a name. That's right. <laughs> And I'm tough. You don't seem like it, but I'm going to take your... Oh, you're tougher. Okay, it's a relative statement. Tougher than you. I don't, I don't think that's true. Name's Lou. I'm the brother of Barrett from Final Fantasy VII. Just here, just here to, here to cook, I'm here to cook, oh, the, oh, the best, the best food, the best coffee, mm. And I'm Penny, I'm here to be cute, I'm Francisco.
Francesco, you okay? Francesco? Francesco, you okay? Fran Francesco, you can't. Francesco. Leave it up to Francesco to fuck everything up. I know it's probably Francisco, but I like that Francesco sounds wrong. That felt great, guys. I know it didn't sound great to you, but it sounded great to my soul. Ah, my soul has the biggest ears in the world. Dumbo ain't got nothing on them ears. And them ears said that was amazing. Bow chicka bow, bow chicka bow bow. Hey, Francesco, do you like the silliness that we just did in front of your face right in front of it? Ah, nothing like a cup of coffee after a long day. Hmm, or food. There's, there's something like it. Hopefully everyone got all that singing out of their system. You mean this? Boop. I'll sleep great tonight. <laughs> Just kidding. I never sleep. It's the nightmares. Nobody sleeps on this ship. Hmm. Penny, you got something to say? Penny, after Viola broke my heart, you might just be my girlfriend, Penny. Are you down? Are you down to pirate clown, Penny? It's too bad my part of the song was interrupted. I had a real showstopper ready, let me tell you. Whatever, I'm over it. I've got my coffee now. We don't do a whole lot of sleeping on this ship. Everyone's kind of a lunatic, but in a good way. Being a pirate isn't all fun and games, so I've heard from Francesco. We've got a serious business enterprise here. You told me that already. You told me that already, Penny. Are y'all drinking repetition water? Are those coffee beans? Or repeat beans? I don't know. Hi, Captain Lucas. I'll get back to your dumb voice in a minute. Hi, Nina. Yeah, coffee! <laughs> hey, where'd your witch friend goes anyways? She went somewhere to be a dick. I don't know. She's an asshole. Love coffee so much. Drink it every day. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good for you, Nina. You know, you're tidy. I still don't know if you're a child or what, but I'm going to guess that because you're a pirate, they just let you do things. And age doesn't matter here. Except Lou. Warms my heart to see everyone with a nice cup of coffee. <laughs> All so young and full of caffeine. And sexuals. Don't talk about them sexuals, Lou. So what you think of my cooking anyway? Oh, uh, it was... Uh... <clears throat> good! It was good! I've been on this ship a long time. I know, you know what, I know. The things you've seen, all of you want to tell me your stories twice. But you know what, you don't get twice the value. Or the appreciation. I only appreciate your stories once. What's up, Captain Lou? Ha <laughs> ha! Great singing out there today, matey. Something about you really lights up the music in me heart. You know what's funny is that I could actually do like a good Irish accent or a good Scottish accent, and for some reason my pirate accent is a really bad version of both of those at the same time. I don't know what's going on. Let me know when you want some coffee. Yeah. Well, ready for some coffee? Um, you know what? Not yet. I'm gonna go find Miriam, guys, but I'll come back. Well, all righty then. Yeah. I'll come back. I just want to find Miriam. I want to see where she is bringing everybody down within a five mile. Oh, okay. I can't, I can't go up top anyway. So never mind. All right. I'm ready for the coffee. I hate coffee. I'm not going to tell you guys that, but I really do. But I'll drink it for you. Well, ready for some. Yep. 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 Give it to me. Give it them beans, friend. Watch the spirit. How do I drink it? I love me some caffeine. Really gets me buzzing. So tell me, matey. You ever seen a mermaid? <gasps> oh, not this again. Ah, shut it, you scallywags. Have you? Uh-oh, I feel a romance. I feel a romance coming on. I was just a lad. A no-name on some crew. When we found ourselves in the worst storm you ever heard of. We didn't stand a chance. The ship went down. I was drowning. I saw me knife flash before my eyes. And that's when I heard her. As my vision faded, a beautiful voice singing from the deep. When I came to, I was safe on some shore. She saved me. Her music 
is the music of me heart. My mermaid savior. Of course, after that, they all vanished for years and years. Say, matey, you're not drinking your coffee. I was sorry, I was just so engrossed in your story. That was keeping me awake. You were my caffeine. Oh, ha, yeah. <laughs> I was totally distracted and also a little nervous. I've never had this stuff before. Never had coffee. Mate, you've never lived. Give it a drink already. Um, okay. Wow. Well? Drink the coffee. Coffee is life. Drink the coffee. Coffee is life. Fuck, drink the coffee. Fiance, fuck, coffee is life. Fuck, drink the coffee. I need a coffee, and a fucking coffee. And she's the coffee. You gave me coffee. Nobody I mean, should have given me coffee before. So why I've never drank this shit. It's all about coffee. Oh my god, it's fucking caffeine. It's so good. I mean, it's so fucking good. I love how he sleeps. Me, 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 me. Get up, get up, little plague. Hi, did you sleep well, my darling? Oh, so good. How is everyone? Oh, wait a minute, what? Huh? Hold on a second. Oh yeah, okay. I'm sorry, I forgot the layout of the ship for a minute and I thought you pulled some shit while I was asleep. Hey, Lou. So, finally awake, eh? What happened? What happened was, you caused a real ruckus is what happened. And you ain't never having any coffee ever again. Guys, they did that, not me. Like, typically all of the zoom-ins have just been my editing so far. That was all Lou, honey. <laughs> all right. What else? What else, Lou? Well, we're docked safe on Tatango Island now. Why don't you get outside and stretch those legs? My legs don't need stretching. Before you lose them like me. Ha 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 ha, amputee. That's not funny, Lou. But I'm glad you keep your spirits up. Are you coming outside too? No siree. I'm just dandy here. Go on now. Do you have peg legs? That'd be cool. Can I see or do you just stay behind there all the time? I don't know. I'm not going to ask you any more questions about your situation. Uh, look at how I run a Maggie in the cargo. I don't have a mouth. My mouth is gone. All right. Let's go say bye to everybody. And then let's check out ta 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 tango Island. Where the ta tango is fierce, fierce, fierce. Coming to you Mondays, Mondays, Mondays. To Tango Island is where dreams come true. I'm not even gonna look at Miriam, cause her attitude sucks too. Hi, Miriam. What's up? Well, hello there, sunshine. Feeling calm down now? I am feeling great. Yes. Well, thank Aya. It's raining outside. That's unfortunate. Is the nexus point here? No. We still have to find the... Guess. Overseer song? This time, I really have no idea who would know it. The nexus point is just on some uninhabited island. This island's got people on it, though. So I guess... Just go ahead and do your people thing. You mean being a decent human being, Miriam? You mean not being a bitch to everyone I see, Miriam? Talking? Yeah, that. God, Miriam. Miriam. There was a time in my life, Miriam, when I believed that everyone was like me, namely perfect. But then I came across you, and I realized some people are just shy of perfect. And it's not because life made you that way. It's because you made you that way. Be better, Miriam. Be better. 
Apparently the pirates sell their coffee beans here. But I wonder where they get the beans from. Ugh, it's hot. I can't tell if it's worse out here or back inside the ship. Please find that song soon. Why don't you go for a long walk off this short pier, Miriam? Jeez. I don't know how I put up with her, I swear, besides the fact that I'm just so sweet. This way to t -t Tango Town. It takes two to tango, Miriam. But in this case, only one of us should go because you just make everybody mad. Boo, boo, boo. Oh, look at everybody. So cute in every one of these sounds. I can't stand this game. I can't stand it. Hi. Who are you? Hi there. I'm a hero in training, as you can probably tell. My parents said heroics had no future, but I have to follow my dreams. So let me know if you hear about any, like, quests. I will. Oh, your name is Hiro. Oh, I've been shopping for the good hero stuff. Getting ready to make my big debut. Look out, world. Got my hero sword and my hero haircut. Oh, actually, yeah, I was about to say, that's cool. You got that anime fringe. That's that Japanese pompadour. <laughs> All the pieces are there. Hero time, baby. Just, uh, need some quests. <laughs> All right, I'll bring you some quests. I'm taller than you. I'm taller than all of you. Are you also a child? Hi, I like your puff. Do you condition? Hmm? Do you detangle those locks? Let's, let's, uh, let's trade secrets. Don't tell anyone, but I actually ran away from home. Oh, actually, I think I should tell somebody that. I'm immediately gonna tell somebody that. I always wanted to travel the seas, but no one took me seriously because I'm a kid. So I took matters into my own hands. Are you wearing one shoe? Well, there's your problem right there. If you have the balls to run away from home, I'm sorry, you're a child. If you have the genitalia to run away from home, but you don't even have the sense of mind to wear two shoes, you need to go back to your parents. Oh, your name is Sydney. You never see this kind of stuff where I come from. It's so exotic, I love it. My parents are probably worried sick. I do kind of miss home. Stowing away on boats and sleeping in cargo is cool for a while. But sometimes it's kind of sad, too. It's not adventure if it's easy, right? I'm sure I'll go back someday. Let that someday be today. Sydney, your parents care about you. And even though you have the cutest little nose, and I would love you to stay here on the island and adventure with me, you can't do that to your parents, bro. You can't. You can't do it. Oh, you don't have anything to say to me? Mm -hmm. All right, fine. Hey, Penny. What's going on, Penny? You want to be my girlfriend, Penny? It's going to happen, Penny, whether you want it to or not. No, I mean, it's going to happen with your consent. That sounds a lot better than what I just said. That was a pretty fantastic freakout you had last night from one coffee. You wouldn't last a second on our crew. <laughs> well, I kind of am on your crew now. Right? Right, Penny? I guess. It don't break my heart, Penny. Viola did it once. I can't take it again, Penny. I only got one heart, Penny. Penny, mend it for me, Penny. Be my girlfriend, Penny? Huh? Normally, I do the bean selling, but I put Francis on job today. Please don't call me Francis. I go by Francisco with everyone here except Penny. <laughs> Look at this monkey in the corner. It's like, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Because she's a deeply rude person with no respect for anyone. Thus, how I can get him to do my bidding. Penny, don't take advantage of people, Penny. I like you, Penny. Penny, I'm going to be right in your face, Penny. Are you two dating? Don't say yes, Penny. <laughs> okay. Penny, plague can't take it, Penny. No. I don't believe you, Penny. When I was a kid, I thought being a pirate sounded so cool. Oh, I'm sorry. So dang cool. But you know what I'd like now? Some nice things. A comfortable life. You know, maybe a duvet. Most parents don't get that. That's why I work my butt off for this crew. Oh. They appreciate you, Penny. Penny, stop talking, Penny. I guess I figured as a pirate I'd be finding buried treasure. But in life, it turns out the real treasure is friends. Is it the friends we make along the way? Please don't say that. It's friendship. Oh, God. Plague, not you. No, coffee beans. People pay top dollar for this stuff. Yeah. What's up, Francisco? I got put on duty to sell the coffee beans. Usually it's Penny's job. Ugh, I'm so bored. 
We're always drinking coffee, so we practically never sleep on that ship. I don't know how anyone can handle this without sleep, though. I want to stab everyone. <laughs> I want to stab everyone in the face. Well, that is a very healthy way to handle things. Would you like some coffee beans? Would you like some coffee beans? <laughs> Would anyone like some coffee beans? Francesco, simmer down like your coffee beans. Oh my God, she is beautiful. Oh, and she won't even say anything to me. And look at this, look at this monkey. This monkey got moves. Can you do this? Oh, you can't French toast like I can, monkey. You know what? I'm not even gonna continue to embarrass you in front of your owner. Hello? Hey, yeah, uh, welcome to And Bomb Shop. You want bombs? Cause that's pretty much what I got. Are they bath bombs? Why would I want bombs when I am bomb? You know, to blow stuff up. It's fun. I'll pass. Say you're out in the world and you see a big suspicious looking crack in a wall. You'll wish you had bombs then. <laughs> Cracks always mean treasure. Cracks also could mean ass. That's a weird reason to carry bombs around all the time. Sheesh, what kind of adventure are you on anyway? A cool one with pirates and singing and other stuff too. But no bombs, snore, yawn, zeds. Hmm. Oh, look at this snooty. Yeah, of course you have nothing to say. Oh my God. Oh my God, guys, new girlfriend. Hi there, cutie. Oh shit. <clears throat> All right, play cool, Plague. Plague, you screwed it up with Viola. You screwed it up with Penny. Just, just, just play cool. You look so helpless and adorable. Are you lost? Uh, nope, I, I totally am not. <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> I'm from far away too. I'm an adventurer, you might say. Oh, that's cool. I'm also an adventurer. <laughs> I bet you are. How's your adventure been so far? Um, good? You know, really like epic and stuff? Yeah, you're doing a really good job of playing it cool, Plague, just like Ace. Fight lots of big monsters? I, I mean, some of them were big, yeah, but I thought the size of the monster didn't matter. You don't have to impress me. You're so cute as you are, really. Oh my god. Good luck on your adventure, cutie. Oh my god, you! <laughs> Damn! Alright, you. I'm coming back for you, baby. I'd say that was real smooth, Plague. Ahoy! Oh, what's up? Everybody looks so cool. Oh, look at you! It's the golden fisherman's old granddaddy that's from the place where his skin's a little darker and it's fine. What's up? How do you do there, whippersnapper? We're not used to seeing your type in our little spot here, but don't worry, we're friendly. Why not join us for a coffee? Even you guys? Oh my god, Bernie. Oh, sorry you dropped out of the race. The sea is a harsh place to make your living. There's no room to be mean in a world like that. Oh my god, I feel the same. This is our place and time to be friends together. Let's cherish that. I love you, Bernie. You are the future of our- I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. I'm gonna make me cry. What do you think you're doing here, Pipsqueak? Uh, huh? Cool it, Marcus. The weirdo's with us. We're cool. So step off, you jerk. Before I beat your ass. Oh, sorry about that. My wife recently left me. Made me feel emasculated. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not laughing at your pain. I'm laughing at the fact that you acknowledge that was just a projection of your toxic masculinity. So I felt the need to assert my physical dominance, playing out my masculine insecurities. You see? 
Uh, I'm glad you understand. No, I'm glad you understand. I remove myself from the situation now. Oh, you didn't have to leave. When somebody learns, they grow. And when somebody grows, they can stay, you know? Ah, what a jerk. Are you a doctor? That's a doctor, bro. You can tell. You can tell that he goes for runs and he's like, bro, 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 I'm Dr. Bro. And like, it's my medical bro opinion, bro, that you should, bro, drink lots of coffee, bro, and run, bro. Do you guys take lots of shits? I hear that coffee makes you take lots of shits. What's up, Cap? Mo Capitan, thanks for sticking up for me. No prob. Hi, enjoy yourself in here, matey. Marcus is a jerk, but everyone's mostly cool here. We chill here whenever we're at a -ta tango Everyone here loves music, too. You'll fit right in. Oh, is that so? Does that mean if I sing, everyone's going to react to it? Let's see. Oh! No. I don't believe you, Capitan. I'm standing on the table now. Apparently, this is what I do. There's nothing like kicking back with a cup of coffee. I feel like you'd be calling it a cup of joe. We pirates can't get enough. Maybe too much. Sometimes we get pretty rowdy. Har, 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 hearted, har, har. Don't be intimidated by the creeps here. I used to, but not anymore. Even if you're small like me, people listen when you talk big. You know, walk softly, but carry a big dick. All right. Just going to get off the table now. Look at, look at Dr. Bro. Dr. Bro was like, bro, don't stand on the tables, bro. It's my medical bro opinion, bro, that like standing on the ground is better for like your circulation, bro. You have nothing to say to me? You're cute. Can I stand on your counter? Can I stand up here? No? All right, I'll get down. I won't cause trouble. I like you guys. Bye. La -ba -da -ba -do, la -ba -do. That's the crusty bean. Oh my God. That would fit in so well. Oh. You. Man. Guys, if I'm about to see a mermaid, you know what? Mm -mm. We're gonna do that in the next episode. I love Wander Song so much. So much, like from the bottom of my tippy tippy toes to the top of my frippy frippy fro. I love this game. So if you like this game too, and you like my videos or anything else on my channel, do Plague and I a favor and please do subscribe. Uh, and I'll be back soon with more of Wander Song, more of Wander singing, more of Wander perfection.